I'm back with the last minute holiday makeup tutorial for only you and yes that is my new hair which I am in absolutely love with so without further ado let's jump right in I'm taking NYX Away We Glow Liquid Highlighter in the shade called State of Flux and applying pretty much all over my face this extra step I'm doing before my foundation because after coming back from my trip to Himachal my skin is not in its best condition and I need to glow for this makeup look so I'm just blending everything with my YBP makeup perfecter but then I just realized that I should have worked on a uh, small area because this product tends to set quickly apart from that this highlighter is amazing then I'm taking my good old favorite NYX total control drop foundation in the shade called classic tan and applying it with the foundation brush you guys know at first I hated this brush but now I know how to use it and I'm in love with it Just to make everything little better, I'm taking NYX Stay Matte but not flat foundation in the shade called Nude and applying it. This is completely optional. If you are happy with your foundation, then you can totally skip this step. Just to set everything, I'm going to spray some Wet n Wild Natural Finish Makeup Fixing Spray and I'm just softly dabbing the product into my skin so that everything can just melt together. For my concealer, I'm taking my favorite concealer combo and that is Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer in the shade called Neutral and the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade called uh, Sand Sable. I'm applying it on my eyelid as well so that it can work as my eyeshadow primer. Now to contour my nose, I'm taking the darker shade from the NYX Sculpt and Highlight Face Duo in the shade called uh, Caramel and just carefully drawing dotted lines following the natural shape of my nose. Now this can be a little tricky sometimes because everybody has different nose shapes so what is working for me might not work for you. So if you want me to do an in-depth tutorial on how to contour your nose, leave a comment for my brows i'm using color bus stunning brow pencil in the shade called chestnut i forgot to short this product but i have used it so many times in my videos so i guess you guys will be fine sealing that with the nyx tinted brow mascara in the shade called espresso i miss this one to shoot as well uh please don't kill me <laughs> Okay, so my brows are done. Time to move on to the most exciting part of this tutorial, the eyes. I'm taking NYX Jumbo Pencil in the shade called Gold and applying it all over my lid and the lower waterline heavily. You don't need to be neat with this step because we are going to blend it anyway. Then taking this super pretty bright gold shade from the NYX Pro Filter palette called Olive View and applying it. The best part of this look is you can actually customize the gold shade according to your liking. If you feel that this gold shade is little too bright for you, you can switch it with your favorite one. But for me, it's the perfect one for Christmas. Blending everything for a smoother transition. Then taking this holographic gold pressed glitter called Indian Touch from Glitter Galaxy and NYX Glitter Primer to add some bling on my eyelids. These are pressed glitters so you don't really need a glitter glue but I am going to wear this look for all night long so need to make sure everything stays in place. Then taking this pale gold shade for my inner corners and for my brow bones from the NYX Pro Filter palette called Golden R. For my wings, I'm taking Nykaa Glamorized Liquid Eyeliner in the shade called Enchanting Forest. I am in love with this green. This looks so pretty, so Christmassy and I was like, you know what, my Christmas look cannot get completed without this green eyeliner. <laughs> to tightline my upper waterline, I'm taking Nykaa I am 24-7 Kajal and for my lower waterline, I'm taking Lakme Iconic Kajal in the shade called Regal Green. Now, if you feel this step is going to make your eyes appear smaller, then just skip it. But for me, I think I needed this step. Going to throw some false lashes, so prepping my real one with the eyelash collar and Maybelline Hypercurl Mascara. Okay, so my eyes are done and now for my face, I'm taking this new launch from Sugar Cosmetics called Contour Day Force Face Palette in the shade called Subtle Summit. Whew, that was a bit of mouthful. <laughs> I'm already in love with this palette. Though I feel the blush shade they have added in this palette could have been a brighter one, but the contour shade and the highlighter is amazing. As I have said that I'm not very happy with the blush, I'm taking NYX Duochromatic Illuminating Powder in the shade called Crushed Bloom and applying it as my blush. And 
for that extra pop i'm taking that uh, highlighting shade from that same sugar contour palette yes i'm using my fingers because i feel it just gives you a more natural finish Now for my four freckles I'm taking eyebrow pencils from Color Bar and NYX and just dotting over my nose dabbing it with my fingers to make it more natural try to use two three different shades of your eyebrow pencils because that way you will have a nice gradient and the reason I chose eyebrow pencil instead of brown coal pencil because eyebrow pencils are way less pigmented than coal pencils and that way you can get more control I hope I make sense I am mostly focusing on my nose and then slowly fading towards my cheeks. Four freckles are definitely not mandatory for this look but I feel freckles look super cute and uh, love my own freckles so just incorporated them. Christmas look cannot be completed without some red lips. So I am taking NYX liquid lip suede in the shade called Kitten Heels. Beautiful red with warm undertones which will suit most Indian skin tones. And with that my look is complete super easy super fun if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel that is very very important thank you for stopping by i really appreciate it i will see you soon till then take care bye and merry christmas